Hallo Leute und herzlich willkommen zum zweiten Part des Specials zu Celestian Tales Ort North. Die mache ich nicht so von Anfang an richtig gesagt. Wie habe ich das nur geschafft? Äh, ich weiß es nicht. Ähm, und ich gehe die jetzt einfach der Reihe nach durch. Das heißt, es werden, äh, es werden dann wahrscheinlich sieben Videos, dass ich den an den, den Part danach noch zeige und entscheide mich einfach so spontan für einen der Charaktere, mit dem ich das dann ein bisschen weiter zeige. Äh, wir Lift. A Life of Wicked. Ich habe keine Ahnung, was der Korum ist. <lacht> Glauben, äh, reiches Mädchen oder reicher Vater, die reichste Person dort. Äh, eine Kreuzzüglerin, okay. Deus könnte irgendein äh, Gott sein. Wofür stand Deus nochmal? Ach, mal, ich, ich sollte mal den Englisch langsam mal wieder ein bisschen aufpolieren. Uh, äh, okay, sie ist nicht sehr tolerant. Das, äh, das klingt ja schon mal an einem tollen Charakter, mit dem ich, ich sie definitiv sehr identifizieren will. Ja, ähm, mal schauen. Äh, reiche, verwöhnte Christin, quasi. Also, bloß nicht Christin, sondern halt der Religion hier. Father, beloved sister and brother, what can I help you with? <laughs> Aria, loyal daughter of mine, has so finished the daily prayer. I've just now honored, Father. Why is it so ask? Okay, es ist irgendein Akzent, den ich sprechen, den ich definitiv nicht nachmachen kann, weil ich ihn nicht, weil ich ihn nicht akut kenne. And how went the fencing practice with my uh, with the mentor? I am an adept at dueling with the sword. The mentor has taught me so at the end of the day's session. Ah, oh, such a certainly good news to hear. <laughs> And what of the history lessons? This is a huge honor, Father. My understanding has far exceeded the class subject. Also, she is uh, relatively potent in fechten. She weit über Szenen ausgeschossen in Geschichte. As a pastime, I have taken up reading my own. I've, I have just finished the founding a few, years, a few days ago. Also ein Buch über die Gründung des, der, der Reiche des alten Nordens oder der Reiche ihres, äh, des, des Gebiets ihres Vaters. Excellent, dear daughter. The achievements are indeed worthy of named Geraldin. I would suppose then that you are ready for this task I am about you to give uh, about to give sure. <laughs> Pardon, uh, honored father what kind of task might it be the task of knighthood dear daughter the queen to go to Levantine and serve as a squire as squire ich baue ständig Wörter ein die da nicht stehen die ich einfach in meinem Kopf lese obwohl sie wahrscheinlich falsch sind tut mir leid <laughs> knighthood honored father am I not joining the ranks of Lagerman, äh, Heiligen? War das in der Richtung? I see that uh, your abilities are far more useful as a knight, dear daughter. Then would not squiring under the pious paladins of Belenos be a better choice? Is there something to wish of me to learn from the wolves to uh, send me so far to Levantine? Indeed, there is, daughter. Indeed, there is. You see, as Bellinus has a strong position in the claim to be blade bearer. They uh, have many candidates in line for the throne, candidates of good upbringing and merit. House Levant, however, there's a reason this lady is mockingly called so far the baron. I see, I have neither, and thus. Do you wish to take the seat of Levantine for themselves? Wie spricht man das aus? Kann man das bitte jemand erklären? So? Ich krieg's nicht richtig hin, glaube ich. No, not uh, for myself, dear daughter. <laughs> uh, I would never be uh, do such a selfish thing. <laughs> I'm rich. I don't need to be selfish. <laughs> this far. Uh, this for us, dear. 
with careful planning, named Jemida and shall rise in power. Also einfach damit er seinen Einfluss vergrößert. Aber nicht über sie hinausschießt. If this is. Uh, if this be thy father, I shall serve our deal. Oh. oh. Ich beweise gerade, dass mein Englisch tatsächlich nicht das allerbeste ist. Ich komme zurecht, aber vielleicht reicht es für sowas nicht aus. Okay. Blessed ever with wonderful children, with the help soon we shall be bearers of a sacred sword. Or oh, sweet, like our logo. Or flag? Uh, or, or color, or color. Yeah. Uh, send me news of anything that happens in Levantine, dear, so shall be our eyes and ears. Dear sister, I shall miss this, so. I cannot imagine seeing the heart. Please take care of themselves for me. I shall send you the uh, as well, sister. We will at least well to father's words. Wow! Wow, was für Gesicht! The road's full of filthy commoners lately, Aria. You should sharpen your blade. Commoners? They aren't even allowed to touch the noble castle. No, those ungrateful creatures are trying to rob us. Of what it's ours? <laughs> was? Wow. Was für ein Arschloch. Ui. Even thinking about it is sickening. I take you to the harbor area. Who knows, maybe I get a chance to take a swing at them. <laughs> I shall send for the leopards. You to prepare for the journey in a few weeks. Very well, honored father. Uh, eine Kutsche. <laughs> I shall miss Scotland. <laughs> of course you will, sister. You'll be living in Levantine after all. Have you heard how nobles and commoners live on the same ground there? What a joke. How have those living outside Gotland endured such a thing, I wonder? To share the ground we step on with peasants? Is it just unfathomable for me? Also, also, unverständlich schätze ich jetzt mal. Only the house of Gotland are true noble sister. That's why only we keep such traditions. The Levens, the Durandals, they are all of impure bloodlines. Ooh, oh, 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 man. Ich, oh, ich, ich mag solche uh, Figuren nicht. <laughs> It's clear from the color of their hair, darkened by the filth and the lineage, so much unlike of golden strands. Indeed, golden skin and hair prove that we stem from the same old ancient ancestry as Lord Rivière. This, as Father has said, we are all better suited to be blade bearers than the Levens or Durandals. We feel slipping in behind the walls of Levantine. We'll, we'll ride that wrong sooner, dear sister. Hey, what are you? Oh, help! <laughs> did you hear that, brother? I did, rejoiced sister. Maybe our entertainment has arrived. Look, it's the Geraldines. <laughs> Talk about luck, they must be stacked with coins and gold. Hand over your belongings now, no words, and we might just let you live. And give us those fancy looking swords too, they'll fetch quite a price. A fancy looking swords? Oh, fine, I'll give you mine to you. May I give mine to you? Well, would you like me to put it in? In your neck or through your guts? You want to do it the hard way? <laughs> Get them! Okay, das habe ich jetzt nicht erwartet, dass man das auf die Weise macht. Gucken wir mal so. Skill and Protection against Shield. Da geht's in Uh, das ist cool, aber einfach erstmal doof da. Okay. 
Okay, überlebt mehr als ein Angriff. Äh, mehr als zwei. Wow! Der überlebt echt viel. Victory! Please, Sir Mercy! Oh, so now it begs for mercy? After threatening to kill us and take what it's ours no less, does she impudence know no limits? I, I was only following you in the order, sir. Our village is starving. We need to buy something to eat. Well, that's your problem, isn't it? Other villagers are doing fine after all. You should have died a hungry, loyal subject, Monroe. Instead, you will now die a hungry traitor. Brother, this one is but a child. A youngster, perhaps, lured into the ways of evil. To art a knight and an inquisition, brother. To murder him, it would tarnish the name. Pah! <laughs> you have a point. I certainly don't want to sully my blade with the blood of those not worthy of killing. Ah, I have a brilliant idea. How about you do it, Aria? Me? I would beg thee to spare him. You're not a knight yet, and... Uh, are you? No oaths, no promises. You can kill him however you want. I I cannot, brother. It's not the way to sh it should be. <laughs> sweet, sweet area. Perhaps reading too many scriptures and staying behind closed doors has made you a very, a very, very naive. Suppose a subject who's attacked his own life according to the law of the dirt. Such a traitor must die. Yes. Those are indeed the words of the scriptures, but to kill one who has surrendered? Then there's no need to hesitate. It's our duty to ensure the laws of the Deus are followed to the letter. I can hear you moving, little boy. If you try to escape, I swear I'd take this horse and chase you down. I'll tie your legs and drag you until we reach the port, then draw your life. You hear me? <coughs> now where are we? Uh, where, where are we? Uh, <coughs> it's about my nephew, little sister, wasn't it? Nighthold is filled with fighting, dear sister. You will kill someone sooner or later. Think of this as a training, a test to mark your coming of age, so to speak. I. I do not think I am ready for such a thing. Fine, then I shall do what I just said and drag him to the harbor. But perhaps, to add a little more taste, he should be flayed before drowned. What do you think? Can you imagine the pain, the agony I will inflict upon him until he screams for death? Der will ihn auch noch foltern? Alter! Please, there's no need to such a horrible act. Then do it. I just can't to five, sister. If he's still alive by then. <laughs> no, please. I have a sister waiting for me. I beg you, miss. I'll do anything. I pray so, though. May find peace. Wow. She's been crying the whole trip? Yeah, and she looks very ill. Is this... Uh, is it seasickness? Maybe she looks... as if she's just on the verge of crying. I don't dare to ask, so you know how the Geridans are with commoners. Uh, yeah, I know what you mean. I feel bad, but I guess it's safer to just leave her alone. I'm sorry. I am truly sorry. Okay. Der Charakter ist definitiv äh, ordentlich charakterisiert worden. Und 
das äh, skippe ich mal. Das habt ihr in dem Video von Renan schon gesehen. Und ja, genau, auf den wird schon wollte ich. Ähm, ich weiß schon mal, welchen Charakter ich nicht weiter spiele. Auch wenn es natürlich ein interessanter Ansatz ist und man event und vielleicht ist es auch so, dass man eh alle äh, komplett kennenlernt und nicht nur über den Charakter spielt. Äh, aber die Gespräche gerade mit dem Bruder sind mir sehr unangenehm und äh, ich, ich, ich finde es interessant, aber ich finde zum Beispiel jetzt Rena schon mal deutlich interessanter. Aber trotzdem, auch wenn es ein Klischee ist, wenn es zwei blonde Geschwister sind und der eine kann schon ziemlich viel, aber naja. Äh, Denken wir mal nicht über die Parallelen nach <lacht> zu anderen Fantasy rein. Ähm, aber ich glaube, das ist recht üblich. Aber äh, interessant war es definitiv. Und ich hoffe, es hat euch gefallen. Und ich wünsche euch äh, ja, irgendwas. <lacht> Gehabt euch wohl. Euer Sinn.